good morning guys welcome to today's video i have to check and see what i'm carrying around on me uh today uh, it is friday is the weekend we have super fun plans with our family this weekend comment below what are you doing for for the weekend what are your um what are your amazing weekend plans and if you don't have anything planned tell me what you plan to do uh, to just relax and enjoy your weekend I love weekends you guys Technically, we could probably take pictures of our horses out here in this field. And also, I think Sam should cut this field. I think the hay is pretty much ready to be cut. We're just waiting for it to dry out. Can't cut hay when rain comes every other day. So we're waiting for a nice dry spell. And then poof, this hay is going to be in our barn. Girls beat me to it. They got their ponies already. All of our ponies are still looking awesome. We are nailing this summer. Last summer they got really chubby and our vet got us in trouble. So we, it's a lot of work moving them on and off and on and off. Look, that's how much they use their shelter. It's filled with hay. Who are you riding today? Finn. Finn. It's a Finn day. Oh, I like your light green with your dark green, but listen, we have bad news, guys. Gab, tell them the bad news. What got canceled? Trillium. Her next show. Her next Trillium show canceled. But on a happier note, look at how cute these flowers are. Sophie's Lengen. Lengen a lazy horse. <laughs> Just makes her feel confident. There's a few horses that get lunged before rides. Chance definitely does not need it. It's good for her. It's good for them. You want my riding, my grooming gloves? No, I can't. I can't wear those. Oh, I love them. It makes my hands dirty. Yeah. Wait, this isn't Chance. Yes, this is. <laughs> There's no way. What is that? Chance has white feet. No, he doesn't. He hasn't for a while. <laughs> he has white stockings. Wow. Well, you can see the white. That's called rain season. Yeah. I actually didn't think um, it was Chance. I, I actually us, thought you got the I wrong horse. I told that um, if he didn't try and attack me, I wouldn't try and push him away. <laughs> and he didn't. And I walked behind him, and I walked behind him a chance, and he didn't try to attack me. Oh, that's and good. He didn't his ears. Good. Muddy horse number two. Also, rainy season. It's been raining so much. Hi. One thing that's so good about being at the barn with horses is that while they're like grooming, I can work on my little station here. Here it is, it's all dirty. But I'm gonna show you guys in the next clip, hopefully, that I what it looks like. Okay, so it does not look very good. <laughs> but it is a work in progress, you guys. So I'm gonna show you guys what we have. I actually need to do this at home where I can wash out the bottom of the car because we have sand from the beach in here. But basically, I have my wagon, which I take my grain to the barn with. We have our stool, which I use at home to get on Penny, which is why half the time I can't ride Penny because I don't have anything to get on, which I've asked them to make me something. So I'm gonna have to get after him about that. So I have my my wagon our step stool and then in the middle here i have like a bunch of stuff that is doesn't fit in here i should actually get another one of these and put two of them in here but it's like some cotton i've got some a poultice some regs some water i got chino's boots that he wears if we go on a trail his trail boots got some sunscreen some bug spray some paper towel just in case because sometimes Daisy throws up in the car. And then over here I have like our, our grooming bag and stuff. I don't know if you can see it. I have a grooming bag in there so that I can pack up stuff from here and take it into the barn. So in the top here I have a first aid kit in here. I've got a brush. I got some scissors. I got some boot cleaner and saddle cleaner. I got more scissors. I have my grooming gloves, which I have another one of those. I have to put it in there. So I love these. I keep them always at the barn. I use these religiously. They're my grooming brush of choice. But I find that the boys who can never get their legs clean perfectly at this barn. So I like to be able to carry them around with me. I've got the vet wrap and the duct tape. You guys know what that's for in case there's an abscess happening. I've got some bug spray, some braiding thread and some hoof ointment. Down here, I have Sophie's flag, 
which she loves and she's been using it on chance some bug spray some of this fabulous um, mane and tail conditioner that I told you guys we love this stuff um, an extra hard brush some diaper rash cream we use that on our white horses so you know like so they don't get mud fever I've got this special formula uh, I have huge bottle of miracle groom Shoshin miracle groom so these are things that like we wouldn't use every single day but we would need that we don't really have that much room for in our locker and then on the bottom i have more a lot of this stuff you can't see is like our saddle soap and more shampoo and more shampoo and this stuff we put on our kids boots before a show and i have a bunch of sponges in there also gonna put this bag of riding gloves in there i have a few hair clips and a bunch of elastics because our his, kids are always like needing those at the barn the reason i think that that's such a good idea to put this all in here and make it all like this is because um i always take my van our van is like totally a barn car it has like hay in it and sand and and horse stuff galore it's all horse stuff in here and there are things that i like to have between the barns and that i can't store at this barn because we just have two small lockers I think this is going to work out for us. I hope it's going to work out for us. I'm excited. Anytime we need something, I'll just be able to go in the van and check. And I always have the van with me when we're at a show. So I'll be that mom where people are like, oh no, do you have an extra pair of gloves? Because we forgot our gloves. And I'll be like, oh, yeah, I do. I'll run right out to the van. All right, so I also brought Finn, you know, gold Finn won that beautiful blanket. It says, Reserve Champion Jumper. Well, that is here. It's going to be used for chance. Purple and, and red. I don't know how good that's going to look, but also have this soap that I really want to try. It's Citronella Lavender. And we didn't use it before the last show, but we have a show coming up soon. And we're going to use this. Actually, maybe we did use it. But I want to use it because the Citronella in this repels flies so anytime you like wash your horse in this the smell that's left over will be so good for them all right i guess we're going outside to ride also time to add another case of water kids drink so much water when we're at the barn i'm actually gonna grab these all right we are riding outside i don't know how wet it is looks kind of wet it is still muddy out here look at that cute jump the purple? Oh, I see that purple must go with that purple jump. We're gonna switch because if you guys saw in our last lesson, all the horses looked like they were moving funny, especially Chance, because they the mud has just been. Uh, do you want to carry that so you can lead me? I'll, I'll carry it. Dad will lead you. Okay. Dad's better leader. Yeah, You're a better leader, Sam. He's also better at holding the stirrup. You just put your hand. You're also better at holding the stirrup. All right, so we're gonna go inside. And Chance already seems happier in here. He's like, oh. Chance already seems happier in here. He's like, oh, thank goodness there's no mud. Wow, look at that. He's a Chino. You've turned him into a Chino. Finn, I don't think he ever would have just stood there lazy like that before. Oh. So, so Gabby's been leasing Finn for six months now, and now that show season is here, and we've been like working with Chino and stuff, it's made like a big drift in their riding because, oh yeah, he's so much better now. Oh, I know lately I've been videoing a lot about Chance and Sophie, but this horse literally has. A crushed mouse over there? Well, I will not be picking that up. That was a do job for your dad. But he just looks so good. He's just such a good boy now. I love him. I think we should buy him. I absolutely think we should buy him. Because he's getting there, you guys. He is getting there. I just love them. I love them both. I love this. I'm just, I just love this. I just love sitting here 
know how when your kids are really little and you have to entertain them and sometimes when you just want like a rest you take them to the park and then you just sit there and you watch them when they're big enough to play on their own with your supervision and you just sit there and you watch them and you can kind of veg out but you watch them and you get to watch them enjoying what they love like that's exactly what this is for me that's exactly what this is for me this is them This is my kids still enjoying what they love and me getting to just sit here and veg out and watch them. Grayfin is getting a Painted Pony's horse treat. Painted Pony, it's a Cadbury egg for Easter. Painted Pony, not so small eggs. Not so mini Cadbury so mini eggs. eggs. It's for Dude, you. Oh, all right. Oh, he's like, wow, that looks fancy. It's a it's an Easter egg, it Finn. Good with yellow. Yeah, he yellow. does. No, I tried the color on him. It doesn't work. What do you think? <laughs> He's like, well, all that makes me happy. And it's pouring That's rain. What he looks forward to. Pouring rain again. Uh, Spring is late. Sad news. What? Chance is not like. Um, he's very picky. Yeah, Chance is picky. Isn't this the last? Month? <laughs> he's like, I want more. Isn't this the last month of spring? Yeah, painted ponies. I want more treats, he says. Yeah, try making them with honey. You might like it. <laughs> Sophie found a chance. This is him. He's a bay. If only he was a chestnut. But can you guys see it? Do you see it? He's a chestnut. And he's got a star. They're adorable. It's a rainy day. It's raining, guys. Sophie's like, let's go sh like shopping. Yeah, I, she I just is buy. feeling the need to sh like shop. So we're at Tractor Supply, also known as PV Mart in Canada. Oh, so you can get egg crates for 50 cents each now. Why do they make all chicken things so small? Like all the areas for chicken so small. Like even the coops, they're all so small. Okay, it's taking a turn. So basically, um. Sylvia and I both got a cup. We got one of these big, huge, reduced okay, tell tumblers. Yeah, tell them the um, story. So, um, we were at the cash register, and my mom had the off-white one. So I was like, you have the off-white one. Do you want the white one? Because you said that you got the white one. And I got this pink. So we got pink, and she saved me. I almost got off-white with a rose gold bottom, and this time, and instead, I chose the white with the silver bottom. What color is your bottom? All right, so now we are back at the car dealership and Gabby wants, doesn't want a truck anymore. She doesn't want a truck. And Sam wanted a truck, but now Sam's thinking maybe he doesn't want a truck. And this is the car of Gabby's dreams. It's a Charger, a Dodge Charger. She's in love with this. <laughs> so we're looking at this. It's amazing to see like how much Sam wants to make the girls happy and let them have a say in the things that we do. And I love that about him. So we're going to see what we end up with. It's going to either be a truck or a car for Gabby. No, you'll start driving at 16 though. Yeah, start driving. So, she'd be, yeah, like you'll, you'll learn on your own car. Yeah, I would have to move the seat yeah, up. But what do you think? Do you like it or does it look plain? I like it. It's cute. It is cute. It's like a police car. It's like a police car. Yeah. There's the aux plug. Comes with winter tires in the back. It's sporty. Yeah. All right, well, let's go and look at this, the truck. This is cute. And then that closes. Yeah, super cute. This is actually nice. So like, I don't think I've ever driven in a... The problem is I can't get in this car. Oh, well, if you can't get the in this car... Yeah, you supposed to get in. <laughs> Mom can this is what happens when you're very, very tall. You can't fit in small cars. All right, I think he's going to be able to do it now. You have to start the car and then get the seat back. Oh, look, you can fit in it. Gabby's like, woo! This is the car I want. You might have to put it at the seat up a bit, Sam. I don't know. I have to. Like, how do I do the back? That's the thing about cars they're like floor to the ground harder for me to get in we're trying out the radio oh my gosh sam this is not a speeding car this this is the other car up for negotiation 
It is a, it is well, a. The weird thing is, he gave me keys for the white one. So Did he give you keys for the white one? Yeah. Oh. All right. Well, this is it. This one's it's got nice. a nice kickboard here. So this one does not have as much room yeah. as the charger. The charger has way more room. Like the seats, you sit back into them. So we tried this truck, this Chevy truck, and we're gonna vote. Sam, charger or Chevrolet truck? I'm gonna pick the charger. Charger. Gabby, what do you pick? Charger. What do you pick? Truck. I'm gonna go with the charger because that's what they want and it doesn't make any difference to me. I want them to be happy. It makes a difference to me because the charger seats, you go back. I like love that. I love that. You so it looks like you're gonna get yourself your first car, like Gabby. That. Don't you know that you're beautiful Just the 